Tajik Hunter, NJ.com, here with Miles Hartfield of Sayreville High School, a class of 2015 cornerback prospect who Rutgers recently offered. How you doing, Miles? I'm doing good. How you doing? Very good. Very good. Miles, congratulations on the Rutgers offer. We saw you at uh, at Rutgers camp. It was actually the passing camp uh, last week, I believe, and we actually stopped and did an interview with you at that time, highlighting you as one of the guys out there that Rutgers could be looking at, and uh, lo and behold, they end up offering you. Just talk a little bit about that that process and how you got the offer. Um, well, at the 707, uh, Coach Flood came up to me after our last game for St. Peter's. And I was sitting there, I was kind of bummed because we lost the game by five points. And he came over to me, he said, uh, Miles, uh, can you hop in the golf cart? I said, okay. I didn't know at first what he was going to say or do. Because I just hopped in the golf cart and we drove off. And he, he said that he liked me as a person. He said that I just got to get my grades up to a B because they're at a, like a C plus range right now. And he said that this will be, this is my offer right now. And he said that he's really interested in me as at this point. And he said, I just gotta keep working hard for the next season. Nice, nice, Miles. What are some of the things that Coach Flood told you that Rutgers likes about you? Uh, he said that he likes my agility and my speed to the ball, my breaking speed. And that's really all he said. Cool, cool. Now, over the past few years, you know, every single year it seems Rutgers has landed a player from your high school, Sayreville High School. First it was Dave Maluski, then Daryl Stevenson, um, and last year Delon Stevenson, who I believe is enrolling today. Talk a little bit about how it feels to be the next guy in line from your high school to pick up a Rutgers offer and have them seriously recruit you. It's an honor because all those guys were great players that came down with the high school. Uh, I really looked up to Delon when I was. At, in eighth grade, when I used to go to the football games and watch him uh, run the ball and play defense. I really looked up to the kid and uh, Daryl and uh, Dave, they were really good role models to me and also the young kids uh, that go to Seattle right now. I'm, I didn't really know Dave, David, but I heard that he was a really good linebacker and there was a lot to learn from because I watched his Good, Miles. Football. And lastly, we asked about, you know, how Rutgers feels about you. Just talk a little bit about how you feel about the Rutgers program overall. Rutgers is my number one school, I would say. I, I loved it since I was a kid. I always watched the football games. I love their education. That's all my parents talk about, education. Education comes first. So I love their education. And I love their coaching staff. They're very nice people to be around. And most of my friends go to Rutgers that don't play football. So I just love the campus and love the school. And hey, Miles, you have any plans to get back on campus and visit anytime soon? Yes, uh, when they start their... Um, they're like their camps. And okay. okay, Miles. Well, thanks for your time. This is Tajik Hunt, NJ.com, signing off.